today's tutorial. In this tutorial, we're gonna look at what to do in case you get hacked. So, in the digital world, we said security is very paramount, and sometimes most of us might experience some form of breaches. And in case we fall victim to these things, what should we do? So, number one, you can install and enable firewall on phone or your PC. So, on your phone or your PC, you can download and install firewall. What the firewall does is that it filters incoming and outgoing traffic and denies any unwanted traffic from entering your system. Number two, format your device, be it phone or computer. And after you are done formatting, you update the system so that uh, those malwares won't get access to your computer again and also to delete them from your computer. So number three, reset your online passwords and make them stronger. So if you are hacked and you realize that your passwords have been changed and all that, can reset them and use more complicated passwords. Don't be using your name, your birthday, anything about you don't be using it use complicated passwords like hash 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 star five comma push your feed those kind of complicated passwords so number four delete all apps that you realize that you didn't install them delete everything from your phone or from your pc number five reset your phone or pc back to its factory settings or original settings so you can also do that number six install vpn on phone or pc so you can install vpn to your phone or to your pc and run them what they do is that they protect you on the internet so that that your data that is sent to the internet is encrypted and then you become anonymous therefore hackers won't get access to you number seven in case you are hacked you can consult a cyber security professional to also look into your device for you and correct every errors that the hacker have created you can also consult your service provider to look into your sim card or any other services that you are using and correct every breaches that have been created yeah so number nine install and enable antivirus on your pc on your phone so you can download antivirus apps or enable antivirus on your pc to save your computer from viruses number 10 change your pc's login password or your phone's login password and make it stronger so if you have a password on your phone or on your pc change them and make them stronger so number 11 you can also decide to change your device or change your sim card or your phone and then maybe get a whole new one and protect it start all over again get new files and all that and avoid a hacker this time around yeah so the last one which is number 12 is use a two-factor authentication so it's an extra layer of security to your online account to account on your phone use them you can use app locks and all that and then these two-factor authentication types we have the sms authentication which have the uh, google authentication so now that you are coming to trade cryptocurrency you've taken you through security so you should be mindful so the next is how to apply these two-factor authentication codes on all your accounts